Welcome to another installment of our Droid VPN Settings tutorial series. Today we're delving into a crucial aspect, Droid VPN TCP and HTTP headers settings. But before we get started, if you haven't already, be sure to check out our first video in this series, where we guide you through creating your Droid VPN account. And as always, show your support by sharing, liking, and subscribing to our channel. Let's jump into it. Step 1. Install Droid VPN. Begin by heading to your mobile app store, search for Droid VPN, and download it. Once the installation is complete, launch the app, and you'll find yourself on the home screen. Step 2. Accessing the menu. To access the app's menu, look to the top left corner of your screen. You'll find a hamburger icon. Go ahead and tap it. Step 3. Account settings. Within the menu, you'll see an option labeled Account. Click there to configure your account settings. If you already have an account, simply log in using your username and password. If not, check out our previous video to create an account. Step 4. Accessing VPN settings. Now, let's get into the core of Droid VPN settings. Click on Settings to access the various protocols. Step 5. Configuring TCP and HTTP headers. In the Settings section, locate and click on TCP and HTTP. This is where we'll delve into the nitty-gritty of TCP and HTTP header settings. Step 6. TCP and HTTP headers configuration. TCP and HTTP settings involve three critical elements that we need to configure. TCP port configuration, HTTP headers or payload settings, proxy settings. Step 7. TCP port configuration. Set a valid remote port such as 80 or 443, and also specify a valid local port or leave it as is. Step 8. Configuring HTTP headers or payload. Now, enable the HTTP headers or payload settings by selecting the corresponding radio button. Click on Set HTTP Headers, and a pop-up box will appear. Here, input valid headers and click OK to save. Step 9. Finalizing and connecting. With your settings configured, return to the main screen and hit the Start button to establish your VPN connection. Step 10. Explore more in our playlist. But don't stop here. Be sure to explore our playlist for more in-depth tutorials on Droid VPN, including TCP and HTTP headers proxy settings and UDP settings. Conclusion. That wraps up our guide on Droid VPN TCP and HTTP headers settings. We hope this tutorial has helped you optimize your VPN experience.